Hey guys, it's me, Charlene. I wish the lighting was better, but it um it's very cloudy, dingy looking outside today. I have my blinds pulled up to help the video be clear because if I had the blinds shut, the video would be really bad quality. So, all right, I'm doing a vlog today. What? What else could, would I do? Um, a couple things I was going to talk about. One is, I talk to Leslie a lot about, um, you know, she says she has a signature scent. And I said, well, I don't, but I love perfume and things that smell good. And I was thinking about it, and um, I do like... Secrets Body Mist Jasmine. You probably can't even see it from the lighting and being so bright. But, um, yeah, I wrote down my favorite scents, and some of my favorite scents, and that would be Jasmine, Honeysuckle. I like fresh, clean scents that are warm and inviting, but not really strong, you know. I don't like a perfume that just, you know, it's overwhelming where it gives you headaches. You know, like a clean, nice scent, you know. So, yeah. So, I'm going to have to look for something like that. But, uh, yeah, I do love this, sec this secret, the jasmine scent. There's something about jasmine. I love it. And honeysuckles. It's a southern girl's thing, you know. Um, I also have noticed something. Over the weekend... They was playing a lot of good movies on one of the stations that I have, and it was on, this movie was on my to-watch list, and it's, um, Failure to Launch, and, um, with Matthew McConaughey, you guys may say that different, but that's just the way Southern Girl says it, so, um, Matthew McConaughey and, uh, Kate Hudson, I think those two, they make the best couple in movies I've ever seen. It's like, you know how you watch movies and it's just like you pick the couple. It's like when they make a movie together, they, they just have that connection. And I do. I really think that Matthew McConaughey and Kay Hudson has that connection. Because they've done, um, uh, let's see what kind of movies they've. didn't write it down. I cannot believe I didn't write it down. I wrote everybody else's down. Yeah, I did. Right here it is. I'm blind. Fool's Gold. Fool's Gold. They did Fool's Gold together, and they've probably done a lot more. I just can't remember the other ones. Uh, but I do have to say... Oh, Fool's Gold and How to Lose a Guy in Ten Days. Yeah, that's the one. They have done those two movies together. They may have done more, but they, you know, it's like those two have that connection. Just like uh, Julia Roberts and Richard Gere, I think they make a great couple. You know, like in um, Pretty Woman and uh, Runaway Bride. Those two have that connection, and... Um, Tom Hanks and Meg Ryan, you know, they did, um, You've Got Mail, and they also did Sleepless, Sleepless in Seattle, they, they have it, then we have Adam Sandler and, uh, Drew Barrymore, they did, um, 50 First Dates, The Wedding Singer, they are awesome together. So yeah, I think every time I watch a movie, and if these sh if these couples are together, the movie's usually really good. But yeah, over the weekend I watched a movie. It was um, Failure to Launch with Matthew McConaughey and um, I can't even think of her name, but she was on Sex and the City. I, it just slipped my mind, but yeah, she was on that show, Sex and the City. I, I like her too. Um... But yeah, that movie is really good, so if you get a chance, watch that. 
because it was on my t to watch list and it was really good and it's been out for a while and you guys won't believe this but um, I uh, took my kids to school and um, I came back home and I looked in my driveway and I have uh, this little patch of um, dirt like raised up and I have um, you guys have you've seen my uh, lamb the lamb I have with flowers in it well I have one that's near the road on a little uh, patch of dirt and when I drive when I pulled in my driveway I looked it was gone somebody has stolen my lamb why would anybody do that that's just so so rude I mean gosh I'm so given that if they wanted it that bad they should have asked me and I would have probably give it, given it to them but yeah that was one of my mom's lambs and when she passed away I took her um, flower pots and stuff and that was one of them I have a set of two so um, I had a set just one two, two set and um must have walked right in my uh, driveway, picked it up, and went on with it. Mm. And I'm working on some drawings. Um, I'm not very good at animals. First of all, I'm not that great with animals, but I'm trying to do a dog for somebody. And uh, I try to do a monkey. I'll show you. But I'm trashing him. I, I'm, I'm not going to trash him. I think what I'll do is I will set him aside and then when I decide to work on him I will work on him but, the, but as of right now I mean he's got a lot more work to be done on him but as of right now I just don't I just he's not looking that good but I wanted to show you I mean he was going to be cute ah there he is Yeah, that's a little monkey. So maybe I'll work on him later. And I'm gonna do some more drawings. I love to draw, so yeah, like today. That relaxes me to draw. So I'm gonna be probably drawing some. Since I've got some of the housework done except for laundry. I'm gonna do some more laundry. And it looks like it's just gonna be a rainy, dreary day. And when I when it's rainy and dreary, my fibromyalgia flares up and I hurt all the time. So hopefully the sun will be coming out soon and, and I guess in vitamin C, maybe vitamin C from the sun rays will um, make me feel better. But yeah guys, I, I hope you guys are having a great week and it's hump day. Oh yeah, I know someone's going to tell you about that um, uh, Matthew McConaughey. He has had me ever since he said bullshit. Alright, I'll talk to you later. Bye for now.